Bonjour and good morning from the French Riviera. Currently I am in Nice, France and I wanted to show you a few nice reasons to visit Nice. So obviously no visit to Nice would be complete without a stroll along the Mediterranean. Uh, it's a rocky beach here in Nice. There are some sandy areas uh, if you go a little further down the road, away from Old Town. Uh, and it's a little, little chilly here in January to be jumping into the water. But man, is that water blue. Look at this. Look at that blue water. Look, can you see that? Look how blue it is. Anyway, the water is stunning. So the beach is definitely uh, a good reason in and of itself to come visit Nice. Uh, now I'm gonna head up to Old Town, which is just up over this wall. Old Town is the kind of old original part of Nice. Uh, there's tons of shops, tons of restaurants, lots of great things to do. So let's go up there. So this is Old Town. It is a beautiful area. Uh, and it's full of stuff. Every street's kind of like an alleyway. Uh, all the buildings are so close together because you didn't have cars when they were built. Um, but there's tons and tons of restaurants, shop shops, markets. Uh, it's uh, such a beautiful, beautiful little little area, and very photogenic. It's still about 10 a.m. It's a little too early for much to be open, uh, you know, the French way. <laughs> so, uh, Old Town doesn't have a lot open right now, which means I'm gonna head to uh, the castle, which is like a big touristy castle on a hill. You can overlook and see the whole city. Uh, get some shots up there, see a nice view of the ocean, and then I think I'm gonna head back down into Old Town for lunch. Okay, y'all, this castle on a hill, this is pretty. A uh, lot of steps to get up here. You cannot be afraid of stairs. Uh, but from the top, you get this great view overlooking Nice. You can see all the way down to the airport. And the best part is, it's totally free. Come up, snap a few selfies. Great way to see a nice landscape of the city of Nice. Be a bit of a misnomer. Uh, the castle, it turns out, is like this whole thing. This is all the castle. It's an old naval fort. So the park is part of the castle. The uh, view from down below is part of a castle. The view from up here is part of the castle. It's this kind of huge structure on a hill uh, with lots of little winding nooks and crannies. And I believe, I could be wrong, but I didn't research this for a while. I think there's an elevator around here. So I might be an idiot for taking all those stairs to get up here. But I haven't found it yet. So no luck on the elevator, but I am now headed back down into Old Town because I have worked up an appetite. So we're going to see if we can find ourselves a little lunchtime snack. So next we're headed to uh, Lufila Liva, which is a classic place here in Nice to get soca, which is a classic uh, southern French dish. So for our mid-morning snack here in Nice, uh, before lunch, I wanted to stop and try a Nice specialty, soca. Soca is like a um, kind of a flapjack texture. It is chickpea and flour. Uh, it's a little salty, it's really delicious. Uh, and it's a nice kind of filling street food that you can grab and go. Uh, it's about two euros to get um, a pretty large piece of soca, and I had another two euros for a Perrier. 
and I'm gonna sit here and enjoy my mid-morning snack and the views of Old Town Nice. It's pretty solid. So now that I've had my soca, uh, my little kind of mid-morning snack, I'm gonna take a stroll uh, back towards the ocean, back along the Mediterranean, where I'm gonna meet up with a friend and we're gonna go find a proper lunch. So now I'm weaving back through the streets of Old Town to get back towards the sea. Uh, so we've now officially met up. This is Amanda, everybody say hi. Uh, this is uh, one of my friends from work and we're gonna go find a cute little French cafe to sit and enjoy some lunch at. Uh, it's just about noon, so some of them are opening up now, and uh, Old Town is a little more populated, so I think we're going to have some luck finding a nice cafe. We have uh, just a few hours left to explore the city, but we finished our lunch, so we're going to go try and check out the uh, fountain du soleil the fountain of the sun and a few other uh, neat quirks kind of on our way back to the hotel uh, a few more sights to see we made it to the fountain of the sun uh, it's this kind of cute little square there's clearly like a little festival that was going on over here some sort of uh, like circus or fair of some kind. Um, and the statue's like a, a super cute Instagrammable area. There's all these red buildings behind it. There's some pink buildings over that way. Uh, and it's only about 10 minutes from Old Town where we were uh, getting our lunch. So uh, a nice spot to come down and snap a few photos. So that is our tour of Nice. Uh, we're going to take a stroll along the promenade, along the Mediterranean Sea, back towards the hotel. Uh, thank you so much for coming on this adventure with me, and I hope that you now have some good ideas of what to do when you visit Nice. Uh, I will see you next week in another city. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and leave a comment below letting me know uh, what your dream city in France is to visit. Uh, yeah, I'll see you next week.